Whether you're a beginner needing something simple for YouTube, or you're a professional that requires more advanced features, there's a free video editor for you. So coming up, I'll count down the top five best free video editing software for Windows, Mac, and Linux, going over the pros and cons of each. To qualify, the program must not have any forced watermarks or time limits and allow for the export of projects in a resolution of at least 1080p HD. With that out of the way, let's get started. Coming in at number five is Videopad. If you're an absolute beginner, this program makes it easy to get started with many cool features and the ability to share your creations directly on YouTube, Facebook, and other sites. Videopad has both a free and pro version. While the free plan does lack some of the advanced features, you do get support for stunning video effects and transitions, color control, video stabilization, and built-in audio effects. You also have the ability to export your projects in resolutions up to 4K. Here's a quick example of how easy it is to use. To add clips from your computer, just drag and drop them onto the timeline. I'll add another one after the clip I just added. To create a professional looking transition, click the box between both clips to add a transition. For this one, I'll go with crossfade. VideoPad supports a large variety of formats and is available for both Windows and Mac. In at number four is VSDC. This nonlinear video editor for Windows only is similar to expensive programs like Premiere Pro and Final Cut Pro. Making our top five for the first time, they've made significant improvements to their interface that would have been previously described as clunky. Just like VideoPad, VSDC is available with both free and paid plans. With their free edition, you get a ton of useful features, including transitions, video and audio effects, masking, and motion tracking. It also allows up to 4K resolution for any exported project. VSDC is more than just a video editor, when you launch it, your choices are Blank Project, Create Slideshow, Import Content, Video Capture, and Screen Capture, along with how-to guides for its top features. To quickly begin a new project, select Blank Project. In the pop-up window, give your project a name. You can leave the rest of these blank. The others you may need to change are the output resolution and the frame rate. When you're done, click on Finish. For those of you familiar with the old interface, you'll notice it's much improved. While VSDC is more user-friendly than it used to be, there's still a high learning curve. On their website, in their how-to section, there's an extensive list of tutorials that will teach you how to use it. HitFilm Express takes the number three spot. This is one that many people seem to have a love-hate relationship with. While it is feature-packed to help you create professional quality videos, it does have a steep learning curve and the install process can be cumbersome. Let's get the positive out of the way first. The base version of HitFilm Express includes more than 400 effects and presets, motion tracking, and supports output resolutions up to 4K with no limit on the number of tracks and transitions. Add-on packs are also available starting at around $10, which is a great way to expand its functionality without breaking the bank. Now for the ugly. While the HitFilm Express download and install process is still a convoluted mess, it's actually slightly better than it used to be when you used to have to give the program a shout out on social media prior to downloading the installer. Now when you hit the download HitFilm Express button, it takes you to a pay what you want page. With more features, the more you pay. If you want the free base version, move the slider to the left and select download. Now fill in the required information and select send me the express download. You'll now be instructed to check your mail to grab the installer. In your email, click the Get Your Express Installer link. And finally, after all of that, you can now download the installer. You'll first notice when you launch HitFilm Express that it has a nice interface that's not overly complicated. Instead of dragging your media on your computer directly to the timeline, you can import it from the media window or drag and drop it into the media window first prior to moving to the timeline. Prior to installing, make sure your computer meets or exceeds the system requirements. At least 4 gigabytes of RAM and 1 gigabyte of video memory are needed for basic projects. If you have a newer computer, you shouldn't have any problems. HitFilm Express is available for both Windows and Mac. Before we get to the top two picks, here are four bonus programs that might be worth your time to check out. For Windows, Mac, and Linux, OpenShot is a free and open source program with a low learning curve that is great for beginners. It's still quite buggy, and if you have a low to mid-tier system, you may experience lag. 
for those of you that own a Mac, Apple iMovie is an easy to use program for simple edits. KDN Live, developed for Linux, is another free and open source program with dozens of transitions, effects, and other useful features. While it's also available for Windows and can be run on Mac OS, I don't recommend installing those versions at this time until the bugs get worked out. And for many years, Lightworks has been one of our favorites. For Windows, Mac, and Linux, it's a professional quality editor that's been used in many Hollywood productions. Unfortunately, the free license has too many restrictions, including the max resolution having a limit of 720p, which is no longer good enough. Otherwise, it would have easily made our top five. Now let's head back to the countdown. In the runner-up spot, coming in at number two is Shotcut. This open source program was developed way back in 2004 and is updated on a regular basis. It's completely free and includes a ton of useful features. It offers support for most audio, image, and video formats and allows for the export of your finished projects up to 4K. The video effects include numerous filters, transitions, and color correction to name a few. It features native timeline editing, allowing you to drag and drop your media into the timeline with no limit on the number of tracks for video and audio. The learning curve to use Shotcut is moderate, but in a short time it becomes very intuitive. For example, adding a crossfade is simple. First, drag a clip from your file manager onto the timeline. Add your second clip to the end of the first. Now left click and drag the second clip near the end of the first and let go. Applying it back, you'll now see the crossfade between those two clips that was easy to set up. Shotcut is available for Windows, Linux, and Mac. Taking the top spot at number one, the absolute best free video editing software is DaVinci Resolve. Released in 2004, its free edition is quite frankly better overall and more feature packed than most paid for video editors. It includes just about any feature you would need to create a professional quality project with multi-track timeline editing, trimming, and HDR grading tools, along with support for all major file formats and resolutions up to 4K. Their fusion tools are built in to create amazing visual effects and motion graphics. Also included are their Fairlight tools for audio post-production. It has a great layout that looks modern. For those of you asking how to add transitions using DaVinci Resolve, here's your mini tutorial. After you've added your clips to the timeline, click edit here at the bottom of the window. Now drag and drop one of your clips over the top of the other. In the toolbar at the top, select effects library. As you can see, it's already selected. Scroll down to video transitions and select the one you want. Let's go with barn door. Left click and drag it to the portion of the clip overlapping the other and let go. You'll now see a small box on top of the clip. If you left click and drag the outermost edge, you can change the length of the transition. We'll leave it right there. DaVinci Resolve does have a steep learning curve. Before using it, I'd recommend checking out the tutorials available on their site. It's available for download on all the major operating systems, including Windows, Mac, and Linux. Thanks for watching. All links are in the description. Hopefully this video helped those of you looking for free video editing software. If it did, give this video a thumbs up and share with others. And if you're new to this channel, subscribe and click the bell to stay up to date with our newest top fives and other tech-related stuff here on Tech Umbo.